Time is the strongest and the most independent force on the planet. It covers your face in wrinkles, knocks down the tallest trees, and extinguishes the brightest stars. Time passes, and with it, everything passes as well. Living beings die, objects get destroyed, and emotions fade. In a word, time is a deadly force that destroys everything that exists. But time doesn't only pass and destroy, it also creates. Every second, four babies are born, meaning that by the end of this speech, our population will increase by over 1,500. Music, literature, art, they are all constantly created. Scientific discoveries, medicine, technical innovations, they are all constantly developing and expanding. But still, people are afraid of the destructive side of time. People are scared of losing something precious to them, and they are also scared of losing themselves. Now, let me explain that. If I asked you now, what does life lead us to? Probably the first thing you would think of is death. And that's sad, because if you think about it, all these things you've been working so hard on all these years will eventually just lead to death. Why bother, then, if whatever we do will lose value and disappear with us one day? Well, that's really depressing to think about, and not true. No matter how strong or devastating this force might be, there is one thing that even time will never be able to destroy. The history. Time is not only the future, the present, it is also the past. And that's why nothing actually disappears in time, but stays part of the history. And it is us who will decide on what we will leave behind at the end. Since I can remember, my life has always been very busy. Maybe because I attend three different schools at once, or maybe because I just like being busy. You see, it is not hard to find things to do in everyday life. I always sign up for all different kinds of extracurricular activities, not only because I just like the idea of being busy, but also be because I don't like the idea of wasting so many great opportunities life gives us every day. Some people tell me that I have more things to do than time available, and they constantly ask me, is it worth it? And I always answer, yes, of course. Yes, health's important, and you shouldn't risk it. Yes, your well-being should be in the first place. And yes, you should always have some time for yourself. But being busy doesn't mean that you have to exclude all those things. It might be impossible to manage time, but it is 100% possible to manage yourself and your life. If you can bring all your basic needs and all the activities you're involved in to harmony, then trust me, your life will suddenly become so interesting and fulfilling. If life gives you an opportunity to try something new, something you would never think you could do, as long as you want it, there should be nothing to prevent you from trying it. And trust me, it will always be worth it, because what I learned is that despite any outcome, there is nothing more precious than the experience and the memories that will stay in your heart forever. The most influential people in history, such as Marie Curie, Leonardo da Vinci, Nicholas Copernicus, and many, many others, they all followed their passions and dreams and never feared to try or fail. You see, people are often scared of failing, but in fact, what they are actually afraid of is not failure, but disappointment. Failure is just a state, and it is not the opposite of success at all. It is actually a lesson to success. However, disappointment is a feeling, and in my opinion, it is the worst feeling in the world, because it does not only drain all our positive energy out, but it also makes us feel so weak and unmotivated. That's why it is so important to be able to stand up after a failure, and instead of saying, I failed, say, I found a way of how not to do it, and I have learned my lesson. These people had this mindset. They all took a step forward, and they all helped the world take a step forward as well. And they will all stay in the history of mankind forever. Find your passion. 
follow your dreams, and never give up to make them come true. Be yourself and do what you love, because true success can only happen if you are yourself and if you do it yourself. No one can tell you what your dreams should be, because at the end, it is you who will have to work towards them. We are the future, but we will also be the history. And it is important to remember that, because even though time has the power to flow unstoppably, regardless of any story, you have the power to create that story. Thank you.